want you to hit me as hard as you can. Hey everybody, I'm Tom Barilli and you're watching the Joe Blow Movie Network's Easter Egg Countdown. This week we'll dive into the prequel to Ridley Scott's classic sci-fi horror series with Alien Covenant. Picking up years after Prometheus, this film gives us an origin story of our favorite chest-bursting, acid-drooling xenomorphs. There are plenty of secrets and surprises to uncover, so let's start the countdown. Seen in the bridge scenes and clearly in the prologue video, a hula girl can be seen. This is an homage to the drinking bird which appears in Alien, Aliens, and the working print of Alien 3. The opening title reveal mimics that of the original Alien and Prometheus. Guy Pearce cameos as Peter Wayland, reprising his role from Prometheus. All the droids' names are alphabetical in the franchise, A for Ash, B for Bishop, C for Call, and now D for David. The song David plays for Peter Wayland is Das Rheingold by Wagner. It comes from a piece about a dwarf stealing gold to control the world. This parallels David stealing the black oil to control mankind. Walter, it's time to recharge the energy grid. Walter's name is a tribute to alien producer Walter Hill. James Franco cameos as Captain Branson. Despite only having brief scenes in Covenant, Franco appears in the short film released in advance of the film. And Walter, I will want you and Mother to undergo a complete core code review so we can understand how those happened in the first place. The computer on the Covenant is called MU slash TH slash UR, or Mother. This is the same name of the ship from the original Alien. The orange warning sign on the computer is a trademark of director Ridley Scott, who also used it in Alien, Prometheus, and Blade Runner. Daniel's unique haircut is inspired by Ezra Miller's wig from Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, which was filming while Alien Covenant was in pre-production. The alien spores inhaled on the planet are a nod to William Gibson's unused script for Alien 3, which also featured the alien infection transmitted by inhalation. Shaw's body and the artwork in David's lab are reminiscent of H.R. Geiger's artwork, the inspiration for the xenomorph. The facehugger appears in the same way it debuted in the original Alien. When Daniels jabs a nail into David, he responds, That's the spirit. This is the same line uttered by android Rutger Hauer after being hit by Harrison Ford in Blade Runner. That's the spirit! Serve in heaven, or rain in hell. Which is it to be? During their fight, David quotes Dante's Paradise Lost. This is a nod to the original title for Covenant, which was called Alien Paradise Lost. The scene shot from the POV of the Xenomorph is a technique not seen since Alien 3. Daniel tells the alien, I got you, you son of a bitch! A direct reference to Ripley's line from the original Alien. And that's all for this installment of the Joe Blow Movie Network Easter Egg Countdown. If you caught any Easter eggs we didn't, make sure to leave them in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. For the Joe Blow Movie Network, I'm Tom Barilli.